being attacked. They're trying to take my marble. Don't take my marble. My boars are barely holding out. Uh, right. Okay. What I can do. You need to keep scouting. Keep scouting the border. Oh, they've got a, a city up there. They've got a lot of marble. I thought I only had a. I thought I had the only marble. <laughs> it's looking kind of stiff. Yeah, uh, just a bit. So what's the game plan, Cars? Uh, Carzy, I am planning to do faith culture game. So I'm gonna get the world's largest religion. I'm gonna get that approved as the world religion, and I'm gonna win on a culture victory. If failing that, I'll do a science victory. I don't think I'm gonna be war, not with Ethiopia. Because you're meant to only be fighting bigger civilizations than yourselves. Which wouldn't help if I'm in world spanning empire. So we're gonna play a small game. I think I might be able to hold out here. Are they gonna kill themselves on me? Oh, Jesus Christ, they, s they just keep spawning. They just keep spawning, no. Oh, Robert the Bruce, the Great of Scotland. Hello. Uh, okay, so we got Scotland, China, and Yugoslavia. And you're very wealthy. You're doing pretty damn well. I bet you don't have barbarians at your doors. There's Edinburgh. Okay, I can get a few fins here. Uh, could I get shock? Do I go with heal five additional? Maybe I... Maybe I get the medic. Helps adjacent units heal, which might be quite valuable. Okay, decisive battle! Repel them from our lands! No, oh, god damn it. Fine. Close. Uh, right, you stand here. You might be able to draw their attention away from our main city. Long live citrus religion! <laughs> Glory to the Holy Lemon! <laughs> Damn it, if I had- oh, if I went plantations, uh, that could have been the Citrus King. I didn't know of the Citrus Valley in the east. I might have to fight for that. I really kind of want the Citrus now. <laughs> Beijing is being attacked! Oh my god, Beijing's being directly raided by bar barbarians. People like to smile the most. I am the most unhappiest people in the world. But I do have archers, and that makes up for it. Okay, oh, Glasgow. Wow, China and Scotland are, like, right on each other's borders. Okay, you get out there, you finish that quarry. You finish me that quarry! God damn it. Uh, right, get philosophy. Let's get back on the trail. Now, how is Addis Ababa in terms of population? Beijing is still higher. We're higher than Edinburgh. Demographics show us that, yeah, we are lowest on approval, lowest on soldiers. Uh, the best we're doing in is manufactured goods with a five. Ah, uh, right. I'm still a ways off religion. But if I get that... In preparation for it? Yeah, let's do that. So what that'll do... When I found my religion, I'll get be able to get a Reformation bonus. And with that, I could really shoot ahead in this game. Because if I get Stonehenge, this will nearly double. And I'll be, uh, I'll be able to get to that 200 mark in a few turns. Which will be very nice. Okay, yeah, the Great Scottish Desert. Why the hell are you... Why did you spawn in the desert? Ah, yes, Glasgow, the dry desert city that it is. Sure. Have you ever been to Glasgow? God, sand everywhere. <laughs> Just completely desert. Okay, well, with that, we get plus 10 to our faith. We get more production. We get the Stonehenge in three turns. Next one I want is probably to look up the chocolate. So let's get that going. Okay. Good. Right, move in. <laughs> Don't move, what the hell? 
<laughs> the Yugoslav scout is trapped in the south. Uh, crap, I think we took the wrong turn, guys. Uh, oh, we can't head back now. The trap between the barbarians. I'm surprised they haven't atta attacked them, I'm, I'll be honest. Uh, right. Hopefully I can leave for a time. I've also got the Stonehenge. My disagreements with Wu Zetan has become too much to bear. I'm not going to war with China. What do you mean? <laughs> I have the lowest soldier. I have two warriors. The hinge. We have no combat yes. units defending our territory. And is forgotten under the power of time. I have the hinge. Culture and gold uh, costs of acquiring new tiles have been reduced by 25% in every city. Plus, I have tons and tons of faith. This is going to be a good faith game for me. Oh, I can get the statue of Zeus in 11 turns. I can get... Wow, I can get these in, like, very quickly, these wonders. Now, I will get the Mausoleum of Halakarnassus, Hal 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 because if the faith game goes right, I will be expending great people a lot. And getting 100 extra gold for every great person I expend, that would be very valuable. Uh, just to check. You did not get the Great Library. You would not be building the Mausoleum. Neither are you. Maybe I could build the Archer. Because I would really like a unit. Uh, free terms for an Archer. We'll head for the Archer first. In the meantime, you just try and do something about this. Please. Please do something about this. When we get the Archer, we'll be able to attack without getting hurt ourselves. So that should help. Oh, Mount Sinai. Here is something that that would have been a great thing for me to find or build next to. Unfortunately, it's on the other side of the continent, so it's probably not going to happen. But if we work that tile, now we'll get plus one happiness from just finders. If we worked, we would get plus eight uh, faith. It would have been great for us. Probably not going to happen. I'm the only person, oh, apart from Edinburgh, I'm the only person apart from Scotland actually getting faith or doing a faith game. No one else has a pantheon. Except for that person. Here is something that may be helpful. Okay, heal up. Uh Okay, nope. Right. You Hit them. You you heal up. Cuz we if they disappear that's fine cuz then I can attack the barbarian camp directly. Uh, remove the jungle. Excellent. That gives me 13 extra production. That means I get the archer next turn. I'm about to get my religion next turn. Really early game religion. Oh. Damn it. Okay. N not quite. Ne next next turn, I mean. Okay, with the archer. I you think we might actually be able to range. deal with this. Now we can shoot this from range without getting hurt. Uh, right, Mausoleum of Halicarnassus. Yes. Yes, please. I could get something in my religion that lets me get extra culture and faith from World Wonders as well. And that would just really kill it. Oh, he got the Statue of Zeus. Ah, my great prophet! Yes! The sun shines. Okay, let's found a religion! I have Okay, put you there. Uh move you here. Religion now, what should we be? I think we shall pick Let's go with Catholic. We shall rename this to <laughs> Am I doing the citrus religion, glory to the lemon? But this is in private I've got stone circles, so it should be something stone related, right? Um Let's do the stone. No, I can't just call it stone. What do I call it? I'm going to unite everyone through a peaceful religion. Uh, I'm going to reunite everyone through our peaceful religion with our violent conversion program. No, no, no. Uh, it will only be violent if you consider spamming missionaries into people's lands violent. Because I do not want massive wars. Unless they declare war on me. In which case, maybe... We shall see. Uh, oh, that would be good. 
Rosetta Stone. That is genius, Grey Man. I will take it. We shall be the Rosetta Stone religion. Uh, let's see. I think I'm the first religion in the world. Tithe is usually good, especially late game. So for every four followers, you get an extra gold per turn. Uh, religion spreads through friendly states at double the rate. And a resting influence of 25. Nah, that's pretty damn good. If I was doing a Diplo game, that would be great. I'm doing a culture game, though. Tourism is what I would really want. But I think just getting extra gold would be great. Yeah, Tive. Tive's usually pretty solid. As far as this. Alright, what would be good for us? Plus one faith, plus one culture from National, Natural, and World Wonders. I could get Cathedrals, which gives me plus one faith and plus four culture. Uh, don't want mints and gem cutters, no. No. I mean, something I could usually go for is like the Synagogue, which gives me plus 15 production to constructing buildings just in general. Which is great, especially if I'm building, well, World Wonders, because that gives me plus 15 production to it. I think I might go Synagogue. It's usually fairly solid, even with the the Wonders one. Yeah, let's go with the Synagogue. It's usually fairly solid, especially early game, if I can get the extra production. I could make Addis Ababa just a production nightmare for everybody. So yeah, we'll ignore the rest of these. Some of these are pretty good. It depends what you're after. Um, but yeah, let's go with this. There we go. And because of what am I, one of my social policies, very soon I will be able to get a reformation uh, for my religion. Okay, you help him out. I think we killed them because this... <laughs> you can usually tell because your sight disappears. There we go. So with my small but uh, very nice military, I think we shall be fine. We've got to pump up those numbers, absolutely. Oh, hand axes. Hand axes is the worst. I think they replaced the chariot for barbarians, the chariot archer. Which means that they, they are, they don't fight you. They throw fins at you like archers, so you can't hurt them back if they try and attack you. Uh, and they're just generally really tough, so these are really annoying. Okay, Reformation Belief. Now, there are some really good ones. So, like, the Grand Temple provides plus 5 production, plus 5 gold, plus 5 faith, plus 5 culture, plus 5 food, plus 5 signs. That sounds great. There's also fins like, um... Indulgences and, you know, uh, you know, all this sort of stuff. Plus one signs for every five followers of the faith. Maybe purchase windmills and stuff. There's uh, 100 faith, purchase art halls, all this sort of stuff. We don't want any of that. We want holy sites. Why? Because holy sites are amazing to begin with. They give you a lot of faith. And with this, it gives you extra food culture and science. So I could get a load of culture, a load of faith, a load of food, and science from a holy site which is founded by great prophets, which I'm focusing on, and I will continuously keep getting. So let's get our first holy man. Now I can't use this to reform my religion. I've tried, so uh, this will form my first holy site. Now what I'll do, I'll put it down... Do I want on the grassland river? I'll put on the grassland here. Now this gives me plus two food, plus one science, plus two culture, plus six faith. And now that is one of my best spots for food. So not only does it give me a crap ton of faith, and it will give me more in the future, we are going to upgrade this. Uh, we get a lot of food, culture, yeah it gives us just everything we need. And we're going to keep getting those, and we're going to keep putting them down everywhere. You get a church! You get a church! Everyone gets a church! Well, I still get a synagogue. You get a synagogue! Uh, in fact... What I'll do, I'll reform the religion first, then I'll start spending my money on faith buildings. 
And I believe, yeah, because we're in a wetland, it's easier to attack them. Okay, yeah, we almost killed them. They're pretty close to dying. Uh, what's up here? Anyone else? Anything else? I need to explore west as well. Religion founded. Who founded a religion? Scotland. Damn it. Had to be on our continent, didn't it? Stop doing that. Okay. Hand X dealt with. Truffles. <laughs> You're not having a good time. Uh, ooh, I could get logging. I think what I want, though, is probably this. I can't work the salts, but it'll give me more happiness, which is what I'm after. Scotland has denounced China. The famous Scottish-Chinese uh, tensions. Oh! Oh, they founded a city on the citrus! Ah. Damn it, I might not get my citrus. I won't be able to have a monopoly on the citrus trade. Knowledge. Welcome to the classic land. Okay, classic area on that uh, classic era unlocked. All right, we'll fight our way down here. I do want to start founding our second city. I'll probably make like one last world wonder. Maybe I do in a national college. Maybe I just buy my settler. I don't know. There's so much I want to build on my capital. I mean, I want to be small anyway, and I doubt anyone's going to settle down here. We shall see. We shall see how long it takes for me to get my second city. Sometimes it can take a long time. Uh, what's the next best thing? I think if I just go straight to theology, that's probably not bad. I still need a library. Like, that's a basic science building that I just don't have. The mausoleum, though. I'll get a library next. Library's probably best to do next. Uh, work, uh, warriors, even. You take a quick look over here. Seattle Zababa is pretty damn good. Especially with the religion. We are in, like, five turns. No, uh, you know, yeah, f five turns. Yeah, about five turns. Five, six, seven turns. We shall get our next great person. What I'll do? I'll put my board. Oh, the spearman now! <laughs> How can you produce so many barbarians? It doesn't make sense. I just had war of barbarians. <laughs> Uh, right, yeah, don't worry about the barbarians. Keep mine in the salt. I think... Hopefully we can kill those guys. Uh, right. At minimum, we can take the camp. I don't know if my warrior will survive afterwards, but we can get rid of the camp and stop them spawning there, which is... Good enough to lose the warrior if that's what happens. Okay, we took out the barbarian archers. We'll probably have to heal. Now I've got to focus on dealing with this camp. Which I thought would bother Yugoslavia more, but I'm not even sure anymore. That's the fit. Oh. I'm sort of stuck. I'll, I'll wait a turn. Okay, we have salt. Excellent. That's more happiness for me. Come on, hold out, warrior. Oh. Okay. We lost our warrior. But we gained a mausoleum. Is the tomb of heroic men. And their story is not given only on stone over their clay, but abides everywhere, without visible symbol, woven into the stuff of other men's lives. Excellent. So we gain... Uh, by the way, is my mic okay? I probably should have asked that. I don't know if my mic's peaking or not, because I can turn it down if it is. Hopefully it's fine. Um, so, gain 100 gold per uh, time... Well, 
Gain 100 gold each time a great person is expended. So every time I make a great work or make a tile improvement, I get 100 gold. Plus marble, stone, and obsidian gives me plus 2 gold per turn. So these are suddenly providing me more gold. Uh, yeah, so what I'll do, I'll get the science. It's fine, great, thanks. I'll get the next science building, so I'll get the uh, library. You, yeah, sure, let's bring you down to make a lumber mill. You go here and heal. Most literate people, I have nine techs. That's fine. I can I can get. I'm doing some of the higher techs, so I'm sort of missing part of the tree. So that's not that's not bad. The important thing is the faith game. The faith game is my game. And I'm just gonna be careful of that random spearman that's running around because I don't want them coming and pillaging my tiles. Now there you are. Uh, right. You come back around. I can get. I'll probably get this because it's actually relevant for me right now. Then I'll get the science one. I don't have a grand temple or a normal temple, so I also get the boost for the uh, boost to the gold for shrine and for my holy city. I think it was. Ah, Tentu! Hello! Welcome to Civilization. We are playing as Ethiopia, doing a faith-slash-culture game. Still pretty small, but I think we're far and ahead away from all the other people of religions. After a while, I should be able to start spreading it around properly. But for now, we're just building it up. Just like our civilization. Temple of Artemis has been built. That's fine. I have no interest, in, uh, no interest in the Temple of Artemis. Ah, excellent. Let's reform my religion. Rosetta Stone. Uh, right. Enhance her belief. What I want is where is it? Where is it? Is it that? Plus two gold, plus two culture from great person talent improvements? Or was there something specifically for holy sites? There it is. Plus six faith, plus two production from holy sites. Inquisitor and profits reduce the religion's presence uh, by half instead of eliminating it. So that's what I want. Now, what that means is that my inquisitors and my prophets won't be able to completely wipe out religions when they try and spread. That's fine. Because what this gives me is so... It'll give me so much faith and so much production and it'll... It, I just won't... Uh, you know, forget the production. It'll give me so much faith that I won't have to worry about anything else in terms of faith production in the game. I will always be producing so much faith, I can just keep making great profits, which gets me more great tiles, which makes me be able to buy more missionaries. It's gonna be good. Uh, now, what do I want for this? Now, I could get this. I might be Wonderhorn, essentially. <laughs> so I could get loads of World Wonders, so this could be pretty good. Alternatively, I could... I don't want this. That's kind of useless. Extra gold. I think the World Wonders one is probably for me. Yeah, let's go the World Wonders one. Right, so immediately, this is producing me 12 faith per turn. This one tile. Yeah, I'm gonna be able to do pretty good. What religion are we spreading? We're, uh, we are spreading the religion of Rosetta Stone. Uh, Rosetta Stone. I can't speak. Let me get a drink.
Ah, life giving water. Nectar of the gods. Okay. What's over here? More chocolate? More... Oh, god, there's lots of chocolate over here. Holy crap, there's a lot of chocolate over here. If I could get more chocolate, I could monopolize the chocolate trade and trade it out to all civilizations. Right, National College. National College, great. That'll give me extra... A free extra science, and then plus 50% science in my capital. That's amazing, and it's usually... If I was doing a science game, I would rush that. Because I've done a faith game, I haven't. But this is an amazing building. We're going to build that before we're going to build... Uh, do I build the mosque? I suppose I should build my next settler. And then I build the mosque. Oh, is that the Behringer Crater? I found the Behringer Crater. <laughs> it's right there. It's inside Yugoslavia. And they did take out the Barbarian Camp. Nice. Yeah, you're not gonna get out that way. That's my border. What is dr Okay. Just skip ahead of that. So I got drama. Where should I put you? Oh, there's the hand axe. Excellent. Are not able to name your own religion in Civ Five? It is named. Yeah, this used to be Catholicism. It's been renamed to Rosetta Stone. Uh, let's put a farm down here. What I should be able to do is I should be able to buy a synagogue in three turn, uh, two turns even. And that'll give me extra production towards my buildings. Damn it. Okay, back up. You deal with this. Ah, uh, Sarajevo. I'm sure nothing bad will happen in that city ever. <laughs> it's right next to a crater. What a great city location! That's a massive crater! Uh. I mean, to be fair, it's a great city location. Plus five signs from working that. I have 17 signs total. That would be 25% of my signs, almost. Okay, oh, I, may I might have been able to buy my synagogue then. Oh, this has just come in now, I don't know. Oh wow, this civilization's got catapults? Well, hey, yeah, I, I totally cleared that for you. You didn't clear it yourself and I just walked in. Okay, great, so these city states are almost my allies. Now, if I get allied with them, I get, like, loads of bonuses. In fact, I get bonuses now. So currently, because I'm friends with Lam Islamabad, and they're a mercantile city-state, I get plus two food to my capital. Um, if I was allies, I would get more buffs. And because I'm friends with these guys, I get plus two happiness from some of the luxuries. Uh, so, it's always worth... I mean, you can build a civilization just around uh, getting city-states on side, and you'll need them for the Diplo victory. Synagogue. Oh, this is actually cheaper than I thought. Okay, so that's giving me extra production towards this. If I set my production, uh, my city to a production focus, well, I can't get that in one turn. That's fine. It doesn't make any changes. Henny Gardens have been made. That's a great wonder, by the way. That's plus six food to your city, uh, which is. Yeah, it's pretty damn good. I wouldn't be able to get that anyway if I wanted to, because you need to get tradition for that. Uh, wonder, so I get access to the mosque instead. Well, I think I know the borders of our continent.
I'm doing it. Oh. I guess that man was just so, so shocked by the axe being thrown at him, he died of a heart attack shortly after. Uh, right, what do I want? I want a settler. I can make so much in, like, five turns. I have so much production in this city, it's not even funny. Right, settler, settler, we'll get a settler. Well, I could just do a one-city challenge. Let's get a port going. It's a really damn good city, though. 